My name is Liu Woods, and you probably know me from my brother, Jeffrey. And you may know him better than me, so I just felt the urge to put some information about me outside here. I think that could be a pretty interesting thing at least, and I'm actually a bit curious. So yeah, let's get into this. The first question, how's life? Thank you very much for asking. It's complicated sometimes, but all in one, it's, it's okay. Next question, is Jeff still in your life? That depends on what you meant by this. So if you meant if we see each other quite often, then no. But sometimes I feel if Jeffrey is sad or upset or angry or frustrated or tired. But that also may be just an illusion. But anyway, yeah, I would say he's still in my life, yes. Third question. Why did you save Jeff from the bullies? You know, I hate injustice and unfairly behavior. Back then I knew that Jeffrey will get in trouble for what he did. But at the same time he kind of had the right to defend himself and me. So the only right thing I was able to do was taking the responsibility after I didn't in the moment I really had to. So next question. Leo is your name, home is it Leo or Sally? <sighs> Sally isn't really me. It's a kind of different person I'm just sharing the same body with. I'm sometimes calling him my little parasite, but he dislikes this name. So I think he gets along with Sally quite well. And I'm just Leo. I never really felt like I'm something different. Next question. Is it true that there's a relationship between you and Jane? <laughs> I know Jane. But to be honest, I don't think that I have any great feelings towards her. I never experienced any kind of stuff in that direction. I never really made a confession. So maybe I like Jane without knowing that I'm liking her. But no, I'm, I'm pretty sure that I don't. And I think she doesn't either. Do you like Eilis Jack? As long as people don't get in my way, I'm fine with them. Well, I don't want to judge over a character I don't know really good. And I don't know Eilis Jack good enough to say if I'm if I like him or if I don't like him. I know this is a very unsatisfying answer, but I hope you will understand. How did you get the scars on your face? Oh, that's a kind of difficult question. What kind of idiot you have to be to ask that kind of question? Well, back then, I had this brother called Jeff, and we were asleep. He tried to kill us, but he wasn't able to do so, because you know we are able to defend ourselves. But every fight will leave you with scars on the outside, but every time on the inside. These scars, you see, are only a couple of them we have to suffer off since this little bastard destroyed our whole life. And he will get what he deserves for this. <laughs> Next question. What's your favorite color? A kind of very simple question, but I never had any so far. So if I have to choose, then I would say green or, or blue. If Jeff were to fall ill, would you take care of him? 
Yes. No. Would you rather be stared at on the escalator, across a classroom, a bus, or a subway? <sighs> to be honest, I don't like to be stared on at any place. But if I had to make a choice, then I would say on the subway, so I'm able to just run away. I know I'm kind of obvious with that scars on my face, but I only want to live my life without this weird faces people make when they see me. You know what I mean? So next question. Do you regret taking the blame for Jeff? Regretting something is the best way to just waste your time. Because you can't change the things which happened in the past. You only have the possibility to make the actually day better. And all the time you're spending on regretting something is time you didn't spend make your life better to change the situation you're in now. And that's the thing that matters. So no, I don't really regret taking the blame. Twelfth question. What do you think about the ship of Jeff X Jane? <laughs> well, yeah, he kind of deserves it. And the last question. Leo, what are you planning to do for the rest of your life after you killed Jeff and got your revenge? Well, I'm not sure if I really want to kill Jeffrey. He's still my family, you know. So I, I'm, I'm sure I will not be able to forget what he did. But at least I, I hope that I will able to forgive him someday. And I hope that this forgiveness will be faster than my anger and frustration. I just don't want to care about him anymore. I really don't want to care any longer. But some people we love, even they hurt us like hell. And I'm still figuring out if that's good or a bad thing.